Okay, we're back at the base in chapter 17 of, of uh, Let's Play Fire Emblem Path of Radiance. And I have outfitted everybody with just about all new equipment. Not everybody has brand new equipment. Ike doesn't, but most everybody does. And, or at least everybody that I could get new equipment for. So we should be all outfitted and ready to go. So once we leave, we can't go back. So let's go. And let's take on the rest of the chapter. I didn't give any more experience than I showed in the last part, so... Nothing like that happened. I believe this is the place where we ended our search yesterday. I realized something a couple of days ago. Even in this forest, you always know exactly where you are, don't you? Hmm? How do you know that? Or how do you do that? I think it's the lack of color. But these woods are starting to look the same to me. Yes, that's a problem. Ike, we're approaching a large clearing. I think we should have the Apostle and some of the others wait here. Or wait there. Good idea. Even if we find the Heron today, there's no need for them to tramp through the forest with us. Hmm. I don't think Soren likes that idea. We're going to head deeper into the forest and continue the search. Please wait here. If we find the Heron, we'll send for you immediately. I understand, my Lord Ike. Everyone, please be careful. We're counting on you. Sigrun Tanith, may I entrust the princess to your care? Of course. You've no need to worry. We'll protect her with our lives. Very well. Until later. Well, let's head into the forest then. That's an ugly looking screen color. Uh, are we just chilling out, just uh, sitting around chatting instead of looking for the heron? All right, grill mercenaries, move out. I guess not. Uh oh. That doesn't look good. Gah, haven't you fools found the precious little bird yet? I've no doubt the poor thing is even now quivering with loneliness and cold. Duke Tanis, I've just received word that the mercenaries who invaded your villa are in this forest. Blast those wretches. They're here to steal my bird. Their souls are black with greed and jealousy. I have found, I have found beauty incarnate, and I will not relinquish it. Only I, Duke Tanis, can appreciate its worth. Um, okay. I'm sure that's true, Your Grace, but what about the mercenaries? What shall we do about them? Hunt them down like dogs. Let none leave this forest alive. They will not rob me of my prize. But, Your Grace, they serve at the pleasure of the Apostle herself. Striking them would be... Leave the Apostle to me. I can deal with her once this is finished. All I need from you is silence and obedience. Is that clear? Yes, Your Grace. I beg your pardon. So Oliver has totally and completely lost his damn mind. There they are. Do as Duke Oliver commanded. Slay them where they stand. Let none leave the forest alive. Not man, woman, or child. That's big talk coming from a no-name soldier. Uh-oh. Not the Duke soldiers again. I think it's about time we put an end to these fools. Listen up, everyone. Let's end this here. Yeah. So let's choose our units right quick. I'm actually thinking this looks pretty damn good. Yeah, yeah, I think it is. Now reposition. What is going on here? I don't really. Oh, been an axe. Damn it. Uh, yeah, this is the first time I've really done this. The whole time. Anyway. Okay, I guess route. So yeah, I have to beat everybody, and that's seems pretty simple. But let's see how simple it, it really becomes. They have swords right here, and an axe over there. So, hmm. I guess we can send Volt to that axe guy. And all of them shall fall to Lance people. Alright, that shouldn't be a problem. And, nope, I meant to put Mist right here. Alright, let's just go ahead and get started. 
I am fully outfitted. It took a long time, really. Probably about 10 or 15 minutes. And that's, that's a long time when you're just kind of buying and selling stuff. But it took about that long to get everybody re-outfitted and all that fun stuff. I hope I'm not, like, moving into their range now. Okay. I meant to move Jill into their range, but... I didn't want to move, like, uh... I didn't want to move Rolf into their range. Let's keep moving forward, I guess. Oops, with everybody else. And let's move Nephni here. And Gatry up here. And really just, uh, I guess try to keep everybody, you know, try to keep everybody safe. Hmm. Oh, well. That should be good for the first turn. And these swordsmen should move down just like I thought they would. And, ooh, that's a bit more than I wanted to, to knock off, but okay. Yay, they're coming after us. They are making a mistake. Alright, what are these? Can I walk through these or not? This swamp. I don't think I can. Well, maybe I can. I don't know. Looks like I can. Oh well. It does not appear to alter your stats or anything, so... Okay. Now we need to start killing shit. How do we want to do this? First off, just go ahead and take this guy out with Jill. Simple as that. And we'll leave her there. What does Nephni do to this guy? 14 damage. What about Soren? Soren kills him. In fact, Soren kills the shit out of him. Let's just go ahead and use L Thunder. That kills him and is a hard spell to use. So, get rid of that soldier. Pretty easy with Soren. I do want to move Nephni, but... Hmm. Actually, let's just go, let, go ahead and let Volk take care of this guy. Volk's just about to tear through everybody. He is damn good, that's for sure. And now... You know what, let's let him equip his iron... Or, yeah, his iron bow. That way, this dude should probably attack him. Move Nephni. Yeah, let's move Nephni up this way. And then move Mist up here to... No, not Psychic. To heal Jill. Although I need to probably watch my use of the heal staff. But for now, it's okay. We have enough of it. So let's draw this axe guy down here. And he does go for Boyd, just like I thought he would. And, oh, knocked off 11. Damn. It's a pretty stiff shot. Oh, reinforcements. Oh, damn. Uh, okay. Quick thinking, quick thinking. Obviously, boy can take him out. I think all the bow people can take him out. But let's go ahead and move Gadry down here, too. Not a night killer. Did not want to use that. Uh, I guess let's just go ahead and go with a steel lance. It's not like the, the soldier's going to be able to do anything to Gatry, obviously. Can we move Jill down here? Actually, can we get... We can get one with Nephany. Awesome. Let's go ahead and take that. Okay, that was overkill. But good job anyway, Nephany. And now let's move Jill down. See what she can do. Oh. Hmm. Hmm. I don't like that double. Maybe he does not double her. He still does. Hmm. Let's see. Yeah, I'm thinking about sending Volk up here by himself, because these guys shouldn't be able to do too much to him. I mean, only a 39% chance to hit. But I'll let them come to Volk. I don't want to get too cocky with him. Uh, let's see. Maybe I should just use Rolf. Take one of them down. And then use Jill to take him out. 
Yep, let's do that. That worked out well. That way Jill gets experience, Rolf got some experience, and it's good for everybody. Now we still need Soren and... Uh, hmm. Let's do this. That soldier's gone. So we're gonna get some experience. Now we can move Astrid here. That doesn't take him out. That does. Awesome. Come through for me, Astrid. Good job. Alright, now that one's gone. And I'm just gonna leave her here. Now, where can you attack? You can pretty much move, I'm guessing, anywhere. But we're going to put Ike here. We're going to put Void here. And we're going to put Volk here. So now where are you going to attack? You're going to attack Ike, Void, or Volk. Uh-oh. Void needs to be healed. Damn it. Oh, that's not good. I don't want to use the Psychic Staff yet, either. Uh, oh well. We're just gonna have to deal with it. Maybe Boyd will dodge or something. Or, oh, okay, only six damage. And that poisoned him, though. But I do have something I can heal that with. We have a nice little restore staff. So there goes that poison. And hmm, I wonder if I can steal that pen and axe from him. Nope, I can steal an antitoxin. I don't really care about that. But they're both axe users. Hmm. Let's just do this. And dodge. Sweet. Then we can move Astrid up and just get a quick kill. Just like that. And a level up for Astrid. What is she, 18 now? Yes, she is going to class up. Oh, come on. She will class up pretty damn soon. And let's just leave her there. Alright, now what is going on? We have Rolf who could use experience. Maybe he can take out the soldier on his own. He can not do it. Yeah. He cannot do it. That'd just be 34. Hmm. Let's see what Gatry does. He has an axe, but uh, I think it'll be okay. Oh, come on, Gatry. At least you dodge back. Ugh. Um, I don't really trust Jill. I think she would get hurt, but let's find out. Yeah, that would hurt, but it wouldn't kill her. Let's just go ahead and take it. Probably could have weakened him with Rolf and then gotten the kill with Jill, but... Too late now. There we go. Now Rolf can get the kill. Pretty easy. And Rolf's getting pretty close to a class up, too. Alright, so now where are we? We have two bowmen still here, and the rest of everybody else. Not sure about reinforcements, though. So what I am going to do is move Soren up, because nobody, nobody's right there. Let's move him over here, though. And move Boyd down. And that should guard in case... I get reinforcements right behind me again. At least I hope so. Alright. No reinforcements that I saw. Which is good. But Jill does need to be healed now. Actually, let's move her right here. Heal Jill. And 
Man, this would just be a lot simpler if Ike was not level 20, and then I could have somebody else be an attacker, but it's just not going to work out that way. It's not how it was meant to be. But at least now I can move people closer. Need to make sure Mist stays surrounded so I can do that with Void and Ike. Just like that. Alright, that looks pretty good. Now I can get these next two, the Archer and the Swordsman on the next turn. I can kill both of them. And, wow, the Swordsman missed. Come on, guys. You're a Swordsman fighting a big, huge general knight thing, so you... That's pretty sad. Wait, he had a poison thing, though. So, you can still poison even if you do no damage. That is interesting. Did not really know that. Who do I want to take the cheap experience, though? Nethny! Uh, no. Let's use the Iron Lance. Just go ahead and take that. Take it and run. Now, Miss is going to heal again or restore. Ah, oh, stupid poison. So annoying. But now we've got to get rid of this archer, which Volt can almost do. He'll do some damage anyway. And that allows Jill to. Well, do I want to use Jill or not? Um. I think so. Yeah, that allows Jill to swoop in and get the kill on an archer who would normally kill her. And a level up. What is she now? 16? Sweet 16 for Jill. She has strength and skill. Uh, where's Mist? There she is. Make sure she is guarded. And she is, and that looks pretty good. Although, let's put Gatry here. Now, everybody else should start moving. And, alright, we are doing pretty well so far. We have quite a, quite a bunch of shit here, though, to take out. And how do I want to do it? That, that archer right there is making me a little nervous. I'm sure Astrid can go ahead and take out this guy. Or not. Or if she can't, you know. One of the two. I'd like to wait and use Soren. Actually, they can't reach wherever people are right now. Which is, well, hmm. They have lances, so I don't want to put Volk up there. Oh, dude only does one damage, and if he... He might poison, but that's okay. Let's just go ahead and use it. And... Alright, he missed. No poison for Gatry this time. Now we can send Astrid up, and... Take out the rest of him. What's really fun about Astrid is the hit and run. Now she is back within the ranks and nobody's gonna hurt her. And they'll come and attack Gatchery, which is fine. That is perfectly fine with me. That's actually probably the best thing. He might even come attack Gatchery. Works for me. That's, everything might fall into place right here. And Gatchery is again acting like a little ballerina on the battlefield. And he's going to get a level up. That is going to be awesome. 
Love having a high level gatry. What level is he anyway? 16. Wow, he's gonna get a level up pretty soon. <clears throat> Alright, just making it easier for other people to get kills. I mean, he's getting level ups without even killing people just because he's a wall. And, uh,. He gets experience for getting hit, and his defense isn't even maxed out yet. Hmm. Alright, let's go ahead and take that kill with Nephany. Good job. And a level up for Nephany. Straight at zero, too. Oh, okay. Speed and defense. I guess luck is good, too. Now. Hmm. Now, what to do? What can you do? You can do seven damage twice, and you will probably dodge. Hmm, let's do that. And we can retreat. Oh, you did not dodge, Jill. What is that about? Alright, retreat. Just a little bit. And let's let Soren go up. And ooh, you would counter Soren, but Soren would pretty much just dominate him anyway, so. I don't think he'll even hit Soren. Or, damn it, he will. Come on, Soren. He hits you with like a 39% chance to hit or something like that. I may have made up that number, but it was around that. Really need to heal him. HP is critical for Soren, since he doesn't have a lot of it. Now, where is the next person? Here. Alright, I guess we can push forward now. And they have a sword. Do I have a lance available? No. What does he have? Then an edge. Let's send Volk up. I think he can take that hit. Alright, looks like we are ready. Enemy phase time. He's gonna go after Volk. Volk should... Well, he should dodge. He didn't. I don't know what their problem is with dodging, but they're just not wanting to do it. Maybe Astrid wants this. Do you want this, Astrid? Do you want this kill? Hmm. Who else could use it? I think Nephne could use it the most. Although, that doesn't kill it. That does. Much better. Let's get rid of that Venom Edge. And now we have an Archer and a bunch of other shit up here. But you know what we can do with Archers? We can put Gatry here in the bushes, and the Archer won't be able to do a thing to him. And, hmm... I guess I will restore again. I think I can buy another one. But poison just seems to last for so long and it's so annoying. Might as well just get rid of it and get a level up for mist. Fifteen. Pretty good level up too. Wow. I'm happy about that one. Alright. Let's move everybody up. Make sure mist is well protected. And I think she is now. Looks good to me. Actually move Soren in too. There we go. Now that Archer... I think he's actually a sniper. Oh, I thought he might actually do more damage than that. Oh, wow. A whole three critical hit. Wow. Holy shnikes, that was, that was very intimidating. Let's just go ahead and do some damage with Volk. Damn, he's going to level up soon. And I think Jill would like to kill a sniper. Yeah, she is going to. Oh, how insulting. You got killed by a flying unit. Haha. <laughs> and retreat. And let's heal. Let's heal her. I think Volk's okay. I kind of want to save my heals and be a little careful. 
Now, where do you guys move? Y'all, okay, I have a long way I have to go before pulling you guys. So let's just move up, move it on up. Now, I think everybody's pretty safe now. I don't think anybody's gonna pop up out of nowhere and be able to get to mist or anything. But, do wanna make sure Ike is next to you. And I guess Rolf. Okay, now it's our turn again. Just go ahead and move Gatchery here. How much health does he have? Okay, 31. Not bad. He is he is fine. What is his attack range though? He has a hand axe. So that's not very great, but I think we'll be fine. Let's move everyone up. Everyone up. Every single person. Except for maybe Boyd. No, I'm going to move Boyd up too. Move him up to right here. And Ike to here behind Mist. And there we go. Oh, alright. One whole damage to Gatry. And probably no damage. Nope. Watch him have a Venom Axe, or Venom Edge. It's probably poison now. What does he have? Steel Sword. That's good. And potentially more experience for Nefni. <laughs> I swear, Nefni is just following Gatry around and taking his kills left and right. But now, Astra can get this guy. Well, no, she can't either. Hmm. Not quite killing. Let's see what Volk does. He will probably not hit Volk. Yeah. That was a lost cause. Astrid, however, will hit this guy and will kill him. Bam! More experience for Astrid. Once she classes up, I'm going to take that Paragon off of her. Oh, come on. She has had some horrible level ups. I don't know what her deal is. Alright, what is next? Up here. It's very useful <laughs> to be able to do this with Gatchery. But just to be safe. Uh, just to be safe, I'm gonna look right quick at what everybody's doing. Alright, just to be safe, I'm gonna heal him up. In case something uh stupid happens. And now I can move everybody else closer. Alright, I think we are good. Where'd Miss go? Oh, she's right there. Here comes the mage. Oh, he's gonna attack Gatchery. That's what I was kind of afraid of and planning for. I figured he would attack Gatchery and do a shit ton of damage. Which he did, I was right. But luckily, this guy does nothing. Oh shit, he moves. Oh no. Did not, did not plan for that. Oh, damn it. Okay, at least Gatry survived. And now I have four things to kill. And, uh, not a lot of room for error. Error. Not a lot of room for it. So, who do I want to kill this guy with? Quite a few options, but we'll just go with the one that's been following Gatchery around and picking up the scraps. And Nefni gets all of that experience and a weapon level. Oh, she needed that so badly. She has desperately been needing that weapon level up. That is awesome. Okay, now Astrid can do something. Astrid can actually kill that thing. Let's do it. There goes that, and now we have two mages to deal with. And nice level up for Astrid. She is very close to classing up, and much better level up than I'm used to from her. Let's just 
send that to the convoy. Alright. Now what about everybody else? What can everybody else do to these two mages? Well, Rolf can kill them. But I think I need Soren. Well, I don't need Soren, but... Soren can be helpful right here. By getting rid of this guy and not even taking any damage, right? Well, he wouldn't have, except he dodged it. I think he just wasted energy because he wouldn't have taken damage anyway. But he decided to dodge it. Oh, uh, let's see what he does to Volk. Hmm. Quite a bit of damage, but Volk will dodge. And that'll be the end of that. There we go. The enemy is now routed. And Volk gets a level up. So level, what, 19? Yes! And more speed. Like he needs it. Curses. They just keep coming. How many soldiers does he have? There's no telling. He is a bishop and a senator. He holds prestige. Or, he holds peerage, not prestige. And that means he could command many men. Perhaps we too should call in a few reinforcements. What do you think? It's not a bad idea. And while we wait, we could take a breather and reorganize our attack strategy. Let's do it. So, that is the first part of Chapter 17, so in the next part, we will, well, move on to the next section of Chapter 17. I tried not to say part again. So I'll see you guys then, and thanks for watching.